So you're thinking about a spring break trip? Well, you better get busy. We've got some tips for you here this morning from Regina Novikas from uh, promotionalcodes.com to kind of get you started here. But you say one of your first tips is you probably should have started already. Good morning. Well, that's true. We are in the midst of spring at this point, but one of the best things you can do is book as early as possible because when you're looking for specific dates and specific times, you really want to make sure that you're getting that best airfare. And actually, some airlines will now refund the, the cost difference. If you book your ticket and you find out later on that the price went up, you may be able to ask them for a refund minus a minor change fee. Yeah, I just... Uh... I struggle with this every year. I was telling you during the break that we're getting ready to take our annual spring break trip down to Cabo San Lucas. Got the timeshares down there. So airfare is really our biggest concern. Right. And I play chicken with this every year. I think, <laughs> boy, that's awfully high. Maybe it'll go down a little bit. Sometimes it does, sometimes, sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes it doesn't, right. And it's getting harder and harder to find those. I mean, you can find those last minute deals, but if you know your dates, book as early as possible. And the next thing you can do is really comparison shop online for those airfares. So, you know, with the internet at our fingertips, we can all be savvy savers. It's, we can compare rates for airlines, rental car companies, destinations in general, everything that you want is right there at your fingertips. And we have sites like Travelocity and Expedia there's actually a site that I really love called couponwinner.com. Couponwinner.com, yes. okay. And on there, they have a tool called the Coupon Scout. And you can compare up to five retailers side by side. So you can look at Expedia, Travelocity, Orbitz, whichever ones you want to pick, and find those best coupons and deals and really maximize your savings. Yeah, it's really worth shopping now because I've, I've found, I've put together several trips, uh, some of them even to Europe, online, mm -hmm. by myself. And, and the more I get into it, the more I shop, the more I find, my gosh, there's two-for-one deals and there's uh, deep discounts on buying like before you get to the destination buying online before you get there. Right. Well, what you really want to do is virtually every travel site has a box. When you get to the retailer's checkout page, you'll see a box and it says, enter your promotional code here. And before I knew what that was, I was missing out on huge savings. So what you can do is go to sites like promotionalcodes.com or couponwinner.com or promocodes.com, find tens of thousands of offers from tens of thousands of different retailers. Everything, again, from luggage to rental cars right. to whatever you need for your trip, you'll be able to find and it's organized by retailer or you can search by category you can look click on the travel button you'll find everything you need there now you also said something that's really important here you said to be flexible that means it in many different regards but sometimes just the the day that you're willing to travel is huge right sometimes Saturday travel is much more expensive than traveling during the week so if you can look around and maybe move those dates around a little bit I know you said you were traveling from a Monday to Monday you're probably getting a better deal on right. your airfare that way so I, I shopped at all kinds of different ways and that worked out probably the best right exactly and you can if you're looking at destinations that are very very popular you might be paying a little bit more for that as well so if you're willing to go kind of off the beaten path or off season a little bit you'll save even more you like the idea of thinking local still I still do. It's one of my favorite things. And you can still shop online at promotionalcodes.com, find those coupons for a local hotel. Then you don't have to worry about those airfares. You don't have to worry about the baggage fees. You just pack the family in the car and save that way. Well, since we are a travel destination here in San Diego, that's really a great way to stretch your dollar for a lot of folks here because when the economy's down a little bit, the local retailers and, and establishments they love to have local stay right and you are here a lot of people are traveling from far far away to get to san diego so you might as well take advantage of what you have right in your own backyard yeah we really forget that sometimes right <laughs> all right so uh hottest spots to start first well, hottest spots you actually want to avoid right now in terms of if you're looking for savings, maybe you'll be too, going maybe a little bit away. But maybe. Colorado is actually a good place to go. If you like the outdoors, you want to go hiking, it's supposed to be a great time of year to go right, right now. Colorado, mm -hmm. very early spring. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> early, early spring. All right, so uh, promotionalcodes.com. Yes, go check it out. Find deals on everything that you want for your travel and including for luggage as well right now. Oh, that's the thing I wanted to hit. Yeah. Right. eBags actually through promotionalcodes.com has a great offer. It's 20% off of a $100 purchase. So I just paid. I had a bag that was too small. I needed to bring two suitcases on a trip I recently went on. I ended up paying $100 in airfare check baggage fees. You might as well get that bigger bag and you'll save and you'll get a new purchase too. So think about some buying some of your things that you need for the trip online and using the promotional codes exactly. for that as well. Exactly. Not stack just the trip up. itself. Stack it all up. <laughs> oh, very good. Uh, Regina Novikas, promotionalcodes.com. Thanks for coming in. Thank you so much for having ha me. Happy travels. Thank you. Same to you. <laughs> we'll see you again. Okay.